Yo, what is going on? Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to my Final Fantasy VII Rebirth walkthrough gameplay series. We're here in Nibelheim. Well, not Nibelheim, we're in the Nibel region. And Nibelheim is over here. So yeah, it is our next destination. So let's go. Um, I'm thinking that we'll do anything along the way, you know, until we reach the town. Uh, so, for example, we got this tower over here. That we can activate. Activate. Let's do it. But yeah, if you guys are interested in checking out the previous episode, there will be a link down in the description as usual. You know, full playlist down below. Check it out. A lot of things happened in the previous episode. Uh, we ended up in the village of the Gi and learned a lot about the black materia. So we kind of promised them to find the black materia and... Uh, that led us here. We need to find a Shinra terminal in order to pinpoint where this materia could be, you know? So, yeah. That will be fun. Let me just take care of this. There we go. So, we'll check out Nibelheim, see what's left from. <laughs> I mean,. The town got burned into a crisp, so I'm not sure if there's anything left there. We'll see. That's, you know, Cloud and Tifa's uh, hometown. This game began with a pre... well, with a... Flashback, yeah. Uh, Tifa and... Cloud... Well, well, not Tifa, but Cloud... T uh, well, pretty much told us a story on how he... looked up to Sephiroth, you know, and uh, watched him turn to what he is today, pretty much. So yeah, he is the reason why Nibelheim got destroyed. And that was pretty damn... I'm not going to say epic, since uh, <laughs> it was terrible, but... Um, one, have a, one hell of a cool moment in the Final Fantasy VII story, for sure. Any fan of Sephiroth surely appreciated that. I know I did. Um, how well made it was, you know? But okay. Uh, yeah, we'll follow the path. I mean, there, is, is that a town over there? Hold up. I mean, something's over there. The hell? I got you now. Just scan these enemies. Let's go. There we go. They're nice. Nibelheim's not far now. First time back since. I haven't really seen this part of Nibelheim at all. But yeah, we'll follow the Black Rope men. Didn't think there was anything to come back to. Sorry. Galar Bridge. It's all right. Up ahead should be a town. Stay close, would you? Wow. I honestly thought I was ready for this. What the hell? It's like nothing happened. It's just too real. What is this? Wait, what? I thought. Cloud. 
Look at this. It's... It's... brand new. They rebuilt the whole village. <sighs> Don't scare me like that. Thought Cloud might have lost it again. <clears throat> I mean, I thought he got us lost, because it looks different. So, who do you think we built it? Shinra. Never mind all that. We've got a terminal to find. Okay. You know what? This is kind of fucked up. I mean... Something's not right here. So those creepy outfits you see. Even the water tower is restored. What the hell? Oh shit. A lot of robes out here. Yeah. And look. Locals. Quite the same, are they? Hello there. Can I help you? Greetings, good sir. I am a proud employee of Shinra Resorts. And since I was nearby, I thought I might pop in and check something on the company database. And your companions? Oh, them? They are. I used to live here until. You know. I see. And are you aware of what Nibelheim is now? Nope. No idea. Uh, five years ago, Shinra assumed direct control over this village. It now serves as a treatment center for Mako poisoning. All property rights have been transferred. If that's why you're here, contact Special Facilities at Corporate. They'll be able to help you. Very helpful. Thank you, sir. Ah, but the database. I'll not be a wee minute. It, uh, uh, I'm sure you're eager to see your hometown, but please, don't stay too long. All right, I guess we'll take a look around and we'll talk to everyone as well. We'll start with Aerith. Question. This always been here? Yeah. It totally screams, climb me, duh. So, let's give the poor thing what it wants and see the sights. Hey, don't just... your house that one oh looks cozy <laughs> I'm sorry I shouldn't have said that no don't worry about it it's all new to you That building right there is the end. Where I stayed five years ago. You got the town hall. The general store. And that there? Tifa's house.
So let me guess. This is where you kept lookout. Huh? Come on, you never came up here hoping she'd wave? Probably. Sounds like something I'd do. If I was in your shoes, I would have been up here all the time. I'm gonna head down. Think I'm good where I am. I'll see you later. If you don't mind... Are you angry? Mm-hmm. At me? Not at you. Must be nice. To have a friend you've known since you were a kid. Someone you can say, remember the time when? To someone you can reminisce with. I don't have anyone like that. And it feels like I'm being taunted for it. Which stings. More than it should. That is why I want to be alone. Plus, I might take it out on you, and I don't want that. I don't mind. Well, I do, and it'd only make me feel worse. Thank you, though. Really. I'll be down in a bit. See you then. Fresh air, peace and quiet. Alright, I think that's it. Not I try to so always, you know, exhaust every di dialogue with the characters, since... Uh, you don't really want to miss anything. Whoa, Zack, what the hell? We'll investigate that soon enough. Let me just talk to Barrett first. All these guys decided to get up and shuffle over here of their own accord, do you? Course not. This is Shinra's doing. First, they raise a whole village because it suits them. Then they build a fake one right on top of it. We can't let those corporate bastards keep getting away with this shit. We gotta do something, right? Hell yeah, you're right. Screw them. That's the spirit. Screw them. We'll make them pay for what they did to y'all's home. Alright, you know what? Uh, we'll come back to this area later. Let's go and talk to Tifa. Alright, Tifa is in here. Kind of hard to find. <laughs> Wasn't sure if this was the right place. Uh, but yeah. Wow. A lot of black robed men for sure. So weird. Really weird that, you know, Shinra pretty much rebuilt this just to cover things up. Uh, yeah, you know what? We're not going to play him. No way. Don't got time for that. There's Tifa. I never understood it. Why'd my dad go into the reactor? Why chase Sephiroth? Thought about it ever since waking up in Corel. It just seemed like such a bad idea. I mean, what did he think he was gonna do? Fight a famous war hero and win? Well, he didn't. But after moving to Midgar, after making a life for myself, I finally realized where my- He was angry. And he'd had enough. Everything he'd worked so hard for had been destroyed in an instant. All that he'd built for himself, for us, gone. Sephiroth had burned it to the ground. That's why he went, even though he had to have known how it'd end. I see. And like him, I took my pain, my grief, everything I was feeling. I took it all and turned it into anger. Anger that led me to avalanche. <laughs> The problem is, anger doesn't last. So when Avalanche started to become more violent, there wasn't enough left to hold back the fear and the doubt. It was taking a toll. Then you turned up. Like it was fate. <laughs> yeah, 
like it was fate. A lot's happened, but now that we're here, I know this was the right decision. Because now I know they rebuilt everything, tried to sweep what they did under the rug and pretend it never even happened. But I won't let them. I can't. Sephiroth and his cruelty. Shinra and their lies. I'm sick of all of it. Hey, remember when we were kids? How you'd... I, uh... What? <laughs> Every time we made eye contact, you'd look away. And when I tried to... Not surprised. I was a pain in the ass. I was the opposite. I needed everyone to like me all the time. Okay. Together. I think we're done here. Tifa's old room. Alright. Uh, you know what? We might as well go and check Cloud's uh, old house. Just to see who lives there now. Let's take a little break. Well now. Who might you be? Ah, oh, that's right. You're the ones Nick was talking about. New in town, aren't you? No. Ugh. In that case, you ought to know better than to interrupt a busy chef, hmm? I can leave. No, no, I don't mind. Could use someone to talk to anyway. Then again, I sense you're not much of a chatterbox. Okay, here's the... Hotel, the Nidhogg Hotel. Let's go and check the upstairs for uh, Zack. Here we go. Wow, finally, Cloud. It took some time, but he finally got there. I mean, how could he forget Zack? They were best bros, you know? So... Well, at least while they were soldiers, so yeah. <laughs> oh, that's a relief. Let's go. And uh, check on Kate Sith, I guess, now that we're done. Uh, I've explored this town. There's not much to it. Not anymore, at least. Um, oh, here's Red. Never mind. Something about that place doesn't sit right with me. You mean Shinra Manor? Oh, sorry. No one wants to hear people badmouth their hometown. Hey, I'm with you. Never liked that place. Just looking at it gives me the creeps. Hopefully the company's not using it anymore. I keep asking myself... Alright, like I said before we got interrupted, uh, there's not much to this place anymore. Besides, you know, the card players... So I'll probably edit out everything that's, you know... 
not necessary since we've already seen the town how it was before. It's a replica, pretty much. Yep. We'll go with yep. Some of them even form naturally. No way, naturally? Oh man, you got my mouth watering. Ready to get started? Let's sanga. Okay. All right, so Kate Sith. Oh yeah, he's in well the town hall. We do have some side quests as well, but we'll save those for later. Either on my own time, or if you guys would like to check that out, let me know down in the comments. Um, otherwise, we'll stick to the main story, since this is a long game, as you guys already know. Excuse me, good sir. Would you be so kind as to grant us entry into Shinra Manor? Don't you have clearance for that? Oh, if only. I'm but a wee bottom feeder. Barely have clearance to use the bathroom, B. Be that as it may, I can't let you in there myself. You'll have to ask my boss instead. Meaning the Deputy Commissioner? Or the Commission himself? Let's meet and greet. Deputy Commissioner Murasaki's up at the reactor, conducting an inspection for corporate. He's due back the day after tomorrow, but he hasn't been in touch to confirm. Could be he needs more time. Ah, uh, we can't afford to dilly dally. Then we'll just have to track him down. Agreed. Thanks for all the help, pal. Okay. Let's go. Being a caretaker. All right. Let's take a little break. And try. So you're headed to the reactor, huh? Headed to the reactor. No luck at town hall, I take it. Gotta get a key card. A guy named Murasaki has it, but he's inspecting the reactor. Well then, you'll need a ninja to accompany you. I'm coming with. Me too. Really? You sure? <laughs> Ask anyone around here. I'm the best there is. All right. You sure you're gonna be okay? We're going on a hike and getting a key card. How tough can it be? You'll still be gone for a while. Sure there's nothing you need to take care of? I'm putting you in charge of provisions. Then make it snappy. My materia needs me. New bridge just went in, you know. Might shave some time off the trip. Sounds like a plan to me. All right, reactor word ho! new bridge okay looks like we have a shortcut to the reactor not bad the first time we were here with Sephiroth uh, we had to climb all the way up a fun little detour because we didn't have this bridge <laughs> nice perfect the rebuilt bridge Ooh, a weapons chest. Awesome. Could it be a pair of new gloves for Tifa, maybe? Or a sword? Gloves, let's go. It's been a while. Um, let me just take a look at him real quick. Oh yeah, those gloves are a nice upgrade. Now we just really want a new sword for Cloud. It's been a while since we got one that was actually good. Uh, that can, you know, 
store a lot of materials on it and stuff like that. Oh, I see where we are. Did you? That's why you've been acting weird. Didn't want to upset you. That's all. Zack was my friend. How can I just forget him like that? Degradation. It's hollowing me out. Bit by bit. You're wrong. You remembered, Cloud. It'll be okay. It will. I know it. Thanks. We gotta tell Eric about this. She deserves to know what happened. Yeah. Yeah, she does. But let me be the one to do it. Why? Because she and I are close, you know? Hey! Are you two done yet? Yep. Be right there. Let's just keep this between the two of us. Promise? Alright. I already knew it, but yeah, Zack was one of the soldiers uh, when we were here with Sephiroth. It's a shame that he... Well, maybe... I'm not going to say died, but, you know... Went away like that. We don't really know what happened after that, so... Hopefully we'll get some answers soon enough. Alright, since we do have a resting spot over here, I think that this could be it for today's episode. Yeah, this is going to be it. So, thank you so much for watching. I really hope that you guys enjoyed. Let me know down in the comments on what you guys think about this series so far. And, uh, you know, Nibbleheim. <laughs> and yeah, we'll continue from here in the next one, alright? Take care. Peace. Bye for now.